with another episode of Shop Talk. Today our guest is Andy Morris, the director of golf here at Anthem Golf and Country Club. Andy, welcome. Thanks, Kyle. Appreciate it. It's great to be here. Yeah, happy to have you, man. So if you would, just let the members know a little bit about your background, where you came from, how you ended up at Anthem. Uh, wow, I could go, I could make that a long story uh, if you want to. Um, so I was born outside Chicago uh, in a little suburb called Evanston. Okay. Uh, but when I was pretty young, 10, uh, 10 and a half years old or so, uh, we moved to Houston, Texas. Uh, and I grew up mainly there in a suburb called Katy, uh, Katy, Texas on the west side of Houston. Uh, so that's where I went to junior high and high school. Um, and then uh, college at Texas Tech out in west Texas. Awesome. Um, and then there's a whole bunch more of the story I could go into, um, but I ended up in the golf business um, and ended up out here in Arizona, um, originally working at the TPC okay. uh, seasonally. Okay. Uh, and then I went to a club in North Scottsdale named Mirabelle. Right. Um, started living here year round uh, after I'd been there a year or two. Um, and then about a year and a half ago here to end. Awesome, very, yeah. very cool. So you've traveled around quite a bit then. Yes, yeah, I think I've lived in seven or eight states. Okay, played a, played a lot of golf around the country, even maybe uh, outside. I've been lucky, yeah, played okay. play a fair amount of golf, a little bit outside the country, sure. a lot uh, in the U.S. Uh, what's your uh, favorite course that you've, that you've played? Favorite golf course uh, that I've had a chance to play uh, is definitely, not a contest, National Golf Links uh, on Long Island. Okay. South Hampton, New York. How about one course you haven't played but you'd like to? Ooh. That's a long list. Okay. Uh, if I have to just pick one, it's uh, it's going to be hard to pick one. I've never played Pebble Beach, uh, and I've never played Augusta National. Sure. Those would be the top two. I'm cheating by not giving you just one, but it's one of those two. I, I can't decide right now. Right, right. Um, tell me more, a, a little bit more um, about uh, just your personal background, family. What do you have, brothers, sisters? Sure. I've got a uh, younger brother and an older sister. I'm a middle middle kid. That uh, okay. explains a lot about me. Yeah. Um, <laughs> there was a stereotype about middle kids. Um, my brother uh, and sister both still live in the Houston area along with my mom. Uh, and then my dad lives in uh, just outside Austin, Texas. Okay, very cool. So when you're not working or playing golf, what do you like to find yourself doing? Um, I like outdoors. Uh, it's one of the appeals uh, to golf for me as well, as it's time spent outdoors. Uh, big into biking. We do a lot of uh, road biking, um, so that's a, oftentimes a day off activity for me. Uh, like hiking, backpacking, that sort of stuff. Lots of outdoor activities. Awesome. Very cool. Uh, is there anything that you'd like to share with members that maybe they don't know about you? Fun fact? Um, fun fact about me, uh, before I got into the golf business, I didn't learn to play golf until I was 20 years old. So yeah. I was a late comer to the game. I know you learned, started learning when you were a young kid. Yeah. Um, I'm kind of the opposite. I, I learned as an adult, um, but I actually worked after college. I have an information systems degree, okay. uh, and I worked as a database manager for five years uh, for a consulting company uh, before ending wow. up in the golf business wow. um, and then becoming different a golf world. professional. Yeah, a whole different kind of a. Uh, my golf career has been a lot longer. It's definitely my uh, my passion and, and what I where I want to be with life. But uh, had a little stint before golf uh, in the IT world, so awesome. very different. Awesome, very cool. Well, hey, I appreciate you taking time out of your, out of your busy of schedule to uh, you know, answer these questions, and uh, I know the members enjoy having you here, so thank you for your time, and uh, thanks. thanks for having me in the uh, Shop Talk Studios. This was fun. Absolutely.